What is evil? Well, exactly. So did, you, did you enjoy the, uh, kind of the dark side of your characters? Yes, it's it's super fun to play evil characters because there's just a lot of latitude. You know, you can kind of be bananas and, and it's allowed, right? You can you're manipulative, you're possessive, you're power hungry, or whatever whatever it is. It, it's all the shades of of a, of a, of a character that you don't usually get to play with such with, with such abandon and to such extremes because it's animation, right? And you can work in all the other stuff that you'd expect from another character, like from a, a heroine, that once you put those things in for an evil character, people are like, oh, they're so, I relate to that, that's so weird, you know? So you get all the colors of the rainbow where um, the heroine oftentimes I think, I think the juxtaposition is what makes characters great. It, the heroine who has flaws, the villain who has humanity, those are the things that we want to see because mm -hmm. we, all, we all sort of walk that razor's edge, some more than others. <laughs> but you don't really view them as evil, do you? You know, that's a really good question. I think, I think that's right. I mean, if you're supposed to play any kind of character, you're not, you, you can't be judging them, right? And so you have to figure out the logic uh, of that person's uh, desires and their world and that whatever they want if, if objectively it seems evil to them obviously it doesn't it seems right it seems like necessary the, necessary and like in, it makes sense in the order of their their private world right so you have to you have to find that logic and then and then it's, it's not evil that's those stakes we all have something that if it happened you would do something bad if it, uh, if I don't someone, even. I don't even think it would be that. It, well, I mean, it doesn't me even to have to be bad. <laughs> right, but but everyone has that capability. So you just have to figure out what the stakes are for your character, because whatever it is is what turned them. And it could be something that happened to you as a kid. It could be something that you hold dear, being threatened. Those things are. Oh yeah. You know, like you just have to kind of hook into that, and then it's not a bad person. It's a person under bad circumstances doing what or they think is very necessary. intense. Uh, needs, you know. Mm -hmm. So, what is evil to you? Guys? Do you, do you yeah. answer that? Like, in in general? In general, yeah. Just spinning that. I mean, I think. I mean, I think. I think it's a lack of empathy. I mean, I think it's sociopathy, right? If you if you can't empathize with another person and you you have no sense of harming them, then that's that's maybe not evil. That's that's being a sociopath, right? Yes, <laughs> but that but that that's evil a condition. That, it creates yes. yeah, it creates evil behavior. I would say so. I think it's sociopathy. That's, that's I will say anyone that hurts animals. That's in in a nutshell. I don't understand my the animal people. My boyfriend is one of them. It's like wait, it's, if it's animals, it's worse than people. I don't get it. Well, because there's there's a there's a because they're because, okay. This they're is why more innocent. This is, because they're, we are their stewards in so many situations. They give, um, we're gonna get real deep here for a second. But what so about I went babies? to this psychic. Don't say, like, well, people get upset about babies too. Yeah, they're in the hierarchy as well. Uh, well, <laughs> I have dogs, not babies. <laughs> but I, you know, but if, I, if people hurt babies, any, I wouldn't. Yes, that. anybody that is. A, okay, I wanna hear about the psychic. We're supposed to, so the psychic said that my dog came back as, now I'm going super weird okay. Hollywood, okay, right? <laughs> but that dogs come back as uh, like higher beings because they are domesticated and they have to rely on us and they kind of give it up to us to take care of them. And that is the closest to like a higher being is to get that kind of trust, right? So I don't know why I said that, but um, beautiful, but it's true, yeah. and I feel like that's the thing when you're when you're we're the steward of like animals on this planet and this planet, and so if you are messing with that, then you are a bad, bad mamma jamma. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm I'm very heated about stuff like that, but that's not what this interview is about. So what did you pull on for the evil? I mean, what did you tap into? Even your characters, what did you, what did you sort of think of when you were, you know, when you were performing? Um, for me, I thought uh, Dr. Poison seems very, um, she's in a lot of pain, physically, uh, for sure, and also uh, there, for some reason, and I don't even know why it spoke to me, but like a lot of regret um, that that she can't compart like she can't process. So uh, 
both the physical, the exterior, and the interior pain? Um, I think um, uh, now that I'm, I'm actually, I started this day not remembering what I did, <laughs> and the more questions I get, I'm like, oh yeah, I remember that day, and I remember what we did. This was a while ago. It was like yeah. over a year ago. Yeah. Um, I think that my character, uh, my approach was to find, to be tickled by things that other people might find gruesome. So, if, if, you know, to, to find joy in, 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 in giving people <laughs> uh, pain. Yeah. Yep. Anyone? Did you look into the comic books before? I did. I. I mean, I watched the movie. Um, I didn't. The. I. I have read some of the comic books, but there was so. She's so different in different mediums that I didn't know what exactly they wanted to bring. I. I had worked with this director before, so I knew. They didn't give you advice. No. So rarely do they. Uh, it's a whole different bag for doing um, voice work. You don't get all the good juicy prep time and stuff like that. So you get the script and and then. Mix it up. <laughs> Thanks again. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.